Members of the Richmond community came together today holding several events to show support for the victims and the students impacted by the violence. Our Cameron Thompson was there and joins us now with an update. We got to get the guns off our streets. Underneath the shadow of City Hall. There are solutions that need to be implemented and we have to come together and say no more guns. Pastors, parents and postponed graduates rally around the victims of Tuesday's shooting. I'm praying for that mother who lost her child and her husband on yesterday. And the wider RPS community. As organizer Ricky Johnson says, he's working with the school system to ensure all seniors and rising students get to have a graduation or moving up ceremony. We cannot let the senseless act of one person kill the vibe of RVA. These kids have worked hard all year long, and as a foundation, our primary goal and our focus is to continue to reward them for the work they have done. Among those who came out was a George with senior wearing her cap and gown. And while she's unsure of when her ceremony might be, she's certain of her message to those responsible for violence. Put the guns down because y'all are killing innocent people and taking them away from their family and stuff. Keep, safe. Keep us safe. Then an Keep hour later and a block away, dozens march around the state capitol. Hey, hey. Oh, oh. All these guns have got to go. Hey, hey. The group made up of mostly parents and students from Mary Munford Elementary. So we're all sad for the families involved. We're sad that we all have to live in fear all the time. And then on top of that, we're sad that we're missing out on so many experiences during this final week, right? Wearing a ribbon with Huguenots colors to show solidarity with them, the crowd also wore orange, a color associated with the end gun violence movement and called on lawmakers on both sides of the aisle to come together and work towards a solution. I'm sure that if people got serious about actually finding common ground and not just making talking points, I'm sure we come to some common ground and reduce the number of tragic deaths that don't just impact the families, they impact the whole community. Like the whole city is shut down today. And that's a tragedy for everyone. Now in the last 30 minutes, Superintendent Jason Cameras put out his RPS Direct email and announced the new dates for the graduations, but said the moving on ceremonies would be canceled. Johnson says his organization, the Ricky Johnson Foundation, still plans to hold something and parents can reach out to him if they are interested. Janine? All right. Thank you so much, Cameron. Richmond Public Schools will remain closed.